Crypto's Rich Boy. Today, we're going to be talking about TCG World Metaverse and the Dragons in TCG 2.0. But before we get started, guys, go ahead and like this video, subscribe to the channel, let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below, and share it with your friends. Now, we have the price. It is up, um, let's see... 11.37% at 11 and a half cents almost 11.49 cents it is coming up so um, that is a very very positive thing um, I think for the short term we are going to sustain this uh, upward momentum and get back to the 12 13 cent level um, for like I said the short term that's what I think we are going to do and what's going to happen. As you can see, if we look at the seven-day chart, we have like the head, we have a shoulder, and we have another shoulder. So this most of the time leads to a bullish momentum price action and a price action upward. Now, if we take a look at the dragons, 0.2 Ethereum. And guys, so 377.50, if you guys want to grab a dragon, um, you guys can go ahead and grab one for under $400 potentially if the gas fees allow it. Um, you know, depending on how much gas fees are, sometimes it's $10, sometimes it's $50, sometimes it's $100, sometimes even more. But that is what that is. So if you guys want to grab a dragon, go ahead and do so. It is 0.2 Ethereum. Let's take a look at the Twitter. So we have 23.2 thousand followers. 19 hours ago guys staking for tcg 2.0 will launch this friday august 19th that is tomorrow where we build the tcg world metaverse put your tokens to work and our tcg staking pools more information coming soon so guys this is going to do a couple things by people locking their tokens away it's going to allow the price action not to be so volatile so actually, I know I called for a five cent TCG yesterday. Not sure if that's gonna happen now because you know it makes sense if people are locking their TCG 2.0 away for six months, twelve months, then they're not gonna be, they're not gonna sell it. So the price action may not go too far down. It's just gonna go up because all these coins are gonna be locked away, and um, you know, and <clears throat> with less supply, more demand. It's going to go up. So, guys, there's one month, three months, six months, 12 month staking terms. You guys can get um, the one month is variable. So, I guess it's whatever, um, whatever percent for that day or uh, time or whatever the case is. Three months is 8%. Six months is 8%. 12 months is 10%. So, the total amount of tokens is uh, 1.5 million for a 12 month. Uh, six hundred thousand for six months, three hundred thousand for the three month, and um, one month is one hundred fifty thousand. I think that's the total amount of coins that can be given out. That's not how many you're gonna get. So the global max stake is fifteen million for each, and uh, the one month it looks like it's not. So the max stake per wallet two hundred fifty thousand. Um, that there's only a max for the one month term. And deposit locked, it is locked for all of these. Harvest locked, uh, there's no uh, locking for the 12 month or six month, but there is a harvest lock for the three month and one month, meaning you cannot get your rewards for the three month or one month until it is completely done. But you are able to take out little by little if you choose to for the six month and 12 month. So that is a positive thing. So even though you're locking it up for longer, those rewards and you can always take back out for the six month and 12 month and um it is not locked like the three month and one month are so that is something that is uh you know pretty pretty sweet um so it does say oh let me go back real quick so it does have a little things on the bottom deposit lot unable to withdraw stake harvest lot unable to claim reward so just like i was saying you're gonna for the six month and 12 month you're still going to be able to claim your rewards whenever you uh you know i would think it's whenever you want maybe it might be every couple days couple weeks um they'll let you unlock a new amount and to be able to withdraw or maybe it's um you could just 
Probably you can withdraw it whenever you want, I would think. But I guess we'll learn more tomorrow when that opens up. And guys, if you haven't already seen, um, when you're in TCG World Metaverse, don't forget to look up. Guys, look how sweet. I know I showed this yesterday, but I mean, those graphics are just absolutely amazing. Look how awesome it actually looks with that. Um... So, new profile pick. Thank you, official TCG. Uh, thank you, official TCG coin, for my latest PFP. Truly a generous NFT community. They're currently giving away a gold plot in the metaverse just to post a picture of your avatar on their party island or in their party island. So, guys, this you know I just realized it has a suit on. So this is actually a very rare dragon. So that is one thing um that you guys can um you know take a look at is the rarity you can use rarity.tools i believe and um you can see let's see rarity tool um rarity tools and then if you guys want to see how rare your dragon is all you got to do is go rarity tools and then once it goes i think you put if you click all collections and you type in tcg then um all right when well, my computer wants to uh there we go tcg i think it's this one let's see should be the one with with all of them in there yeah there we go so number one is owned by david himself number two um which was that mythical dragon giveaway was is owned by half man half zombie and so the one they give away holy mac um it looks like they give away number 10 so guys number 10 let's see is that the same one let's go take a look at it that is the same one that is crazy so um you know they are they you know they're they're giving away some good stuff they're not just giving away price floor dragons they're giving away dragons that actually can potentially if the person chooses to sell it i'm not selling mine but the person chooses to sell it Make some pretty decent money probably when the um even now, but probably when the game opens up. I think the last laser eyes was um went for like one point seven ETH. And um, you know, if you look at it, it even says how much people are selling it for. So if you look, look three hundred and fifty ETH for forty fifty four, um, or a more realistic number for ten seventy eight, ten ETH. So for twenty grand, someone's selling number five. That is crazy. And I think uh, they offered 50 grand for number two. So that is something that if you guys want to see how much different dragons are going for with different traits, you just go to rarity.tools and it tells you how much the different dragons are going for with the different traits. Um, so let's see. Let's take a look. I don't see any laser eyes as of yet. I just got my laser eye, so I'm super excited about it. So, um, let's see. Where is... Okay, so the, the one I just got, it was ranked 110. So the laser eyes, doesn't look like any are for sale as of right now. Um, another way, if you want to do it, you guys can go to um, the OpenSea. And if you guys want to find like different traits... You can just go there, and then it shows you the trait. So there's 58 of them. Oh, okay. So actually not too bad. So guys, if you guys want to laser eyes, 1.05 Ethereum. Somebody is selling, um, you know, somebody is selling this red one with the Santa hat for almost two grand. Um, so, you know, if you have a trait you really want, or you have a trait maybe like you're like, hey, maybe I want um the tcg frame you can just go oh, where'd it go okay here we go tcg frame there's only 150 you can grab one for point oh wow that's actually pretty good um oh let me go back you can grab one for point three nine five ethereum and that ends today so for 734 dollars if you guys want a tcg frame there is one up four grabs 
Um, and so you guys can get that as well. Anyway, um, let's take a look at the TCG.world. I think that was the news for today. Um, and so let's take a look at the TCG world. Keep in mind, guys, like I was talking about yesterday, there's scams going down. Um, people are pretending to be David. People are pretending to be Paul. People are pretending to be the devs. So if you guys want to verify, here it comes. Okay, yesterday it wasn't coming up for me, but it came up today. All you gotta do is copy, paste if you got their Telegram name, their um, Discord server username, or their Twitter username, and you'll get results right away. So I think, well, this is David. So be like, oh, you know what? I think David reached out to me. This is his tag. Let me just see if he's the real deal. Boom. He is the real deal. So now if you say, oh, like, you know, Obviously, I'm not officially part of their team, so if you're like, oh, like, let me see if, um, at Crypto Rich Boy. So if you're like, oh, you know, I reached out to you, and you're like, let me see. Oh, warning, this username that you've entered is not an official world staff member. So it'll tell you if the person is official or not. So I would always, always, always check because... Here's the thing, two days ago, I almost, or a couple days ago, I almost got scammed. Uh, well, I think it was a scam. Someone was like, hey, I'll give you a diamond plot for one of your dragons. I'm like, well, why would they want to do that? Dragon's worth like, like maybe two or three BNB. The diamond plot's worth 20 BNB. And come to find out, people, um, and they're like, we can even get an official person to go ahead and do the deal for us. So that way you know it's legit. So I was like, why are they pointing that out? Like, I didn't even question, like, if, if it was legit or not. Like, why are they pointing out, like, we can even get an official person to do it. Um, then, you know, the next day, I go into the Telegram, and they're like, hey, guys, somebody's impersonating to be me, saying something about dragons and for plots. And I was like, oh, good thing I didn't fall for that. So just be careful. Um, and then we got the map. Let's take a look at the map. See what we got going on. Um, in there hopefully you guys have been able to enter into 1.5 oasis party uh it is still open i was in there last night and uh, i was able to fly around on the dragon and um, go through some hoops and uh i was able to do that actually let me see let me see if i can get paint up let's see if i can um i, I think i oh yeah there we go so I was able to fly around on the dragon, and I kind of took a screenshot of this, and um, and so it's cool. Like when you're flying on the dragon, like it um, those little circles turn blue. So I thought that was really neat because when you fly through them, it turned blue. So I was trying to like do t I was gonna do two and put it in the video, but then um, kind of. Uh, something happened that it, the game kind of like glitched or something and then I kind of forgot so but yeah so look at that guys like flying around on the dragon guys there's probably going to be less than 500 of these in the actual game so get your dragons now because it'd be super super cool to um be able to fly around on a dragon and be one of like a couple hundred people that get to do it so you got your asia your north your forest and your gg tour city um with that being said, that is the updates I have for you guys today. I'm not sure if there's going to be an AMA tomorrow. Um, I guess I'll have to look into that. But I'll be making another video tomorrow, so I'll keep you guys updated. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. And until next time.